Fine is the specialist for durable power tools and application solutions which stand to the toughest continual use in industry and manual trades. Fine has stood for the highest made in Germany quality for 140 years. Introducing yet another professional range from Fine. The Fine Supercut Automotive. The powerful system for vehicle glazing and automotive workshops. Fast, strong and virtually indestructible for its entire lifespan. The Fine Supercut Automotive saves you time and real money. Every professional will be impressed by its performance, quality and long service life. The Fine Supercut Automotive works with innovative oscillation technology, a field in which Fine has been a leading developer for more than 40 years. Up to 18,500 oscillations per minute with a motion of 2 by 1.6 degrees ensure maximum performance with extremely smooth running. The Fine Supercut Automotive works at an incredible pace. With its unique and extremely durable gearbox construction, the high-performance oscillator is ideal for all glass removal and cutting work. The patented quick-in, quick-clamping system makes convenient tool changes possible in a flash without a wrench. The tensioning element holds tools firmly in place even at the highest levels of loading, with force fit and without play. You won't believe how much time you can save with the Fine Quick In system. With the quality and performance of the Fine Supercut Automotive, you can fulfill your customers' every requirement with optimum results every time. Its 400 watt high power motor with Taco Generator Electronics keeps the speed constant even at high loads. Fine manufactures the Supercut Automotive with the highest industrial quality in Schwäbisch Gmünd Bargau. As the inventor of the first electric hand drilling machine and as the oldest manufacturer of power tools in the world, Fine has unique production expertise. That's the industry tested quality you would expect from the Made in Germany label. The fine professional set for vehicle glazing includes the Supercut Automotive featuring Quick In and a set of accessories with all the most popular cutter blades. Six L blades in different lengths and four reinforced U blades in three different lengths. The set also includes two straight cutter blades, one with an adjustable stop roller, making it the ideal professional kit for all vehicle glazing jobs. Other accessories include a whetstone for the blades and a cover for extra safety when changing tools. The fine Supercut Automotive is available with or without Quick In, which can even be supplied in a separate plastic case. The length of the blade required to cut out the windscreen near the A pillar and the roof can be calculated using the width of the screen print on the side. If the blade is the same length as the screen print or shorter and does not touch the interior covering, then it is the correct length. Before you start, position the fine supercut directly on the bonded part of the glass. Pull or push the fine supercut in parallel to the glass, applying even force. Avoid twisting or tilting the machine, as this could break the blade. With the L blades you can cut cleanly and safely even when space is tight. The blades are sharpened in the angle area. This allows you to remove frames or trims vulcanized onto the glass at the same time as removing the windscreen. Reduce the cutting speed at the corners. Or if necessary, switch off the fine supercut and guide the blade around the corner. On many vehicle models, you can remove the complete pane in a flash using the L-blade. But if there isn't enough room for the L-blade, because the window is set too far down or is obstructed by the bonnet, just use the tried and tested U-blade. 
the U-blade must not extend further than the screen print. If you press the blade below the pane as far as the adhesive bead and about 20 millimeters of the blade is still visible, then you have chosen the correct length. When changing tools with fine quick in for your safety, always remember to fit the protective cover on the blade first. Then open the clamping lever and remove the blade. The U-blade is used with the blade edge held parallel to the engine axis. Press down with your thumb on the tool's clamping element. Now you can close the clamping lever. To avoid damage, maintain a minimum gap of at least 4 to 6 millimeters between the bonnet or car body part and the U-blade. If the gap is any smaller than this, we recommend masking all car body parts with a stable duct tape. This allows you to work confidently without damaging the paintwork. The fine Supercut Professional set for vehicle glazing is ideal for the fast and efficient removal of force-fitted glass. It takes one person just a few minutes to remove panes of glass with minimal tooling time. The fine professional set for vehicle workshops includes the fine Supercut Automotive with quick in and the most popular L and U blades. A straight blade with adjustable stop roller. A scraper knife to trim adhesive. An HSS saw blade. And a stopper knife to remove under seal. Other accessories include a wet stone for the blades and a cover for extra safety when changing tools. The fine Supercut Automotive is available with or without Quick In, which can even be supplied in a separate plastic case. Before you can remove the windscreen, you will need to dismantle various parts, such as the windscreen wipers, trims, water tank cover and so on. This will depend on the vehicle type and equipment. Pay particular attention to electrical connections. For example, for the windscreen heating system, illuminated rear view mirror or rain sensor. The same applies to the removal of the A-pillar interior covering in vehicles with an A-pillar airbag. When removing parts, always observe the manufacturer's instructions. Start up the fine supercut with speed setting level 3 and always start cutting at the A-pillar in the bottom right hand corner. To avoid damaging the paintwork, you should reduce the cutting speed at the corners of the windscreen. The fine supercut can be pushed and pulled with a relatively small amount of force. Make sure that it is always held parallel to the windscreen and is not tilted as this could break the blade. In some vehicles, it may not be possible to use the L-blade in the lower part of the windscreen because of a lack of space. If this is the case, use the U-blade by guiding the fine supercut flat across the windscreen. Our tip, mask corners and edges with duct tape to avoid damaging the paintwork. Use the scraper knife to trim down remaining adhesive to 1 to 2 millimeters. Simply insert into the adhesive and trim back. You can decide the height of the residual adhesive bead by changing the cutting angle. Select speed level 1 to 2 and be careful not to cut down to the body flange. Pre-treat the glass and apply the windscreen adhesive in accordance with the manufacturer's instructions. After removing interior coverings, covers and electrical connections, the rear windscreen or side window is removed, preferably using a straight blade with adjustable stop roller. To determine the correct blade length, place the blade against the adhesive flange. Allow another 10 mm or so in length and fix the stop roller. Select speed level 3 to remove the glass. Don't start up the fine supercut until after inserting the blade in the adhesive. 
you can now move the machine parallel to the glass. The guide roller ensures an even cutting depth. If you find that the blade isn't long enough, you will have to readjust the blade. But be careful not to make the blade too long, as this may damage the paintwork and car body parts. You can move around electrical connections, such as antennas and windscreen heating parts, by lifting the machine slightly. To remove the rear windscreen or side windows on the VW Golf 3 and 4, VW Polo, Lupo and Passat 5 Estate with vulcanized frames, you need a specially developed cutout fixture for the fine supercut. This fixture is supplied as part of the set and is attached to the gear head. The blade is fitted vertically to the fine supercut either with or without the fine quick in system. The blade edge should be positioned approximately one millimeter above the window flange to ensure sufficient pressure on the blade when you start cutting. You can adjust this using the three set screws on the holder. Remember to note the cutting direction of the blade. Press the fine supercut with the holder into the adhesive and guide it around the rear windscreen, applying gentle pressure on the rear of the machine. Start up the fine supercut with speed level three. Make sure that the front set screws always make contact with the glass. In radii it is possible that the rear set screw may briefly lose contact with the glass. With the fine HSS saw blades you can cut through standard solid bodywork sheet metal up to one millimeter thick precisely and without sparks. When you first apply the HSS saw blade to the metal Move the fine supercut up and down. This will result in more saw teeth being used. Use the stopper knife to remove under seal from the vehicle. When it is well sharpened, it can be used to cleanly expose areas of the underbody or door sills requiring repair. This is important when fitting tow couplings, for example which have parts in direct contact with the vehicle body. With the fine Supercut Professional set for vehicle workshops, you can quickly and easily remove force-fitted glass and also bodywork sheet metal and plastic parts. Use the stopper knife to remove under seal. The universal professional tool set for your vehicle workshop. The fine professional set for cargo includes the fine supercut automotive with quick in, the most popular L and U shaped cutter blades and straight blades in various lengths. Plus a scraper knife to trim residual adhesive. A whetstone, a cover for safe tool changes and a traction cable with retainer ring to help you maneuver the fine supercut in hard to reach areas. The professional set for cargo is specially designed for removing force fitted glass and vehicle body parts such as trims and covers on lorries, buses and rail vehicles. Windows can be removed from the inside or the outside in a flash. With its high power motor, the fine supercut has the power to cut effortlessly through even large panes of glass. The fine supercut automotive is available with or without quick in, which can even be supplied in a separate plastic case. Remove all the necessary body parts and trims from the lorry. For easier access to higher parts such as sun visors, use a stable scaffold. With the 38mm Cargo Blade 217 and the traction cable, you can even trim down thicker adhesive beads. It's the easy and effortless way to remove windows from lorries and buses from the outside. This offers great advantages, for example with buses that have an integrated display panel in the top part of the windscreen. If you use the fine supercut for long periods, 
Don't forget to order Fine's certified vibration damping gloves. When space is tight or when you're working with windscreens with frames, the L-Blade 209 is the best choice. It allows you to effortlessly remove hard-to-reach bonds from curved bus and lorry windows. You can maneuver easily around non-removable parts simply by changing the blade position. The fine supercut is guided by the traction cable. The specially designed fine professional set for cargo gives you everything you need. It makes it considerably faster and easier to remove rigidly bonded windows and vehicle body parts from lorries, buses and rail vehicles. With the fine Supercut Automotive, available with or without Quick In, you have everything you need for any special application. Bonded emblems, trims and spoilers can be easily removed with the 081 blades. Move the blade parallel to the surface, being careful not to tilt the machine too much, and cut at speed level 2 to 3. Because bonded trims can be removed without damaging them, they can be reused. Blade 073 is ideal for cutting plastic bumpers and making cutouts for accessories or retrofitted parts such as fog lights, tow couplings, exhaust systems and so on. Because the blade is so narrow, it cuts very precisely. When repairing plastic parts, damaged cut parts can be trimmed off. Chamfering in preparation for repairs can be accomplished with maximum precision. With a few quick adjustments, the fine supercut is transformed into a powerful delta sander. Thanks to the fine quick in system, it only takes seconds to fit the optional accessories, such as the adapter and sanding pad sets. This allows you to create recesses, treat subsurface corrosion and carry out a wide range of detailed sanding work on flat surfaces or in a very small space. Fine professional sets are designed specifically for the job. The following sets are available as a complete package together with the Fine Supercut Automotive with Quick In. The Fine Professional Set for Vehicle Glazing includes everything you need to remove the windscreen from almost any car. With the Fine Professional Set for Vehicle Workshops, the versatility of the Fine Supercut Automotive comes into its own. In addition to removing vehicle windscreens, you can also perform all types of cutting, sawing and scraping work on vehicle bodies. The fine professional set for cargo is specially designed for lorries, buses, rail vehicles and special vehicles. Large windscreens and windows require special blades and that's what you'll find in the cargo set. It combines perfectly with the power of the fine supercut automotive so you can remove bonded windows from inside or outside in a flash. No matter which fine professional set you opt for, the optimum range of accessories in each set is guaranteed to offer significant customer benefit and cost effectiveness for any workshop. The L-Blade range consists of three different lengths, 38mm, 25mm and 19mm. L-Blades are specially designed to cope with the narrow spaces between the glass and bodywork near the A-pillar and the roof. With the sharpened angle area, they can also cut vulcanized strips from the glass. The teeth on the L-Blade are best suited to cutting strong PUR adhesives. Fine U-blades are available in different versions, in lengths of 10 to 95 millimeters. They are suitable for universal use, but particularly for cutting hard-to-reach adhesive beads, for example, under the bonnet. 
With the Tooth Blade 212, you can cut effortlessly through wide, strong adhesive beads. The Hook Blade 217 is primarily used for cargo applications and has an extremely long service life. Straight blades are available with or without stop rollers. With rear windscreens and side windows, the blade with stop roller is used to avoid damaging the paintwork because it allows you to individually adjust the blade length. For lorries, buses and rail vehicles, straight blades without stop rollers are normally used. The scraper knife for trimming residual adhesive is available in widths of 12, 18 and 25 millimeters. To find out about all the types of blade available from Fine, please refer to the Fine Supercut Automotive brochure. This brochure lists all blades together with length details. For vehicle specific applications, please go to the Fine website at www.fine.com where you will find a downloadable list of recommended blades arranged by vehicle type. Blades must be sharpened before each use to make sure they cut effectively and do not break prematurely. To do this, set the fine supercut to speed level 1 and, with the machine running, wet all the cutting edges with the supplied whetstone. In the case of L blades, remember to sharpen the radius too for optimum cutting effectiveness in this area. The Fine Supercut Automotive is the powerful system for vehicle repairs. With the Fine Supercut Automotive and the three fine professional sets for vehicle glazing, vehicle workshops and cargo, you have everything you need to remove bonded vehicle windscreens with professional results. The Fine Supercut Automotive is also ideal for many other tasks, making it an indispensable tool in any workshop. A solution from Fine, the premium manufacturer of professional and durable power tools.